At the cemetery, the authorities appeared to have lost control of the crowd. They were trying to clear a space for the helicopter, which was now carrying the Ayatollah's body, landing almost amidst the mourners. As it touched down, the crowd tried to tear off the shroud that covered the Ayatollah. In the scuffles that followed, the body tipped out of the coffin, nearly fell off the back of the vehicle carrying it away. It was later loaded aboard the helicopter, which immediately flew off again. A hugely embarrassing and highly undignified scene that brought the ceremonies to a temporary halt. It left behind scenes of chaos in the packed burial square. Several people were crushed to death as the crowd lost all restraint. Five hours later, with the mood of the people hardly changed, Iran's leader was finally laid to rest below a screaming crowd of mourners, scenes that once again showed the frenzy the Ayatollah could generate both in life and in death. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullah Assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullah امتلأ المسجد الحرام وخشيت أن يسقط النعش من كثرة من يريد أن يحمل الشيخ عندما ذهب به للصلاة عليه وعندما أخرج من المسجد اجتمعت في جنازة ابن باز رحمه الله الحشود والجنود والوفود والبنود تزاحمت فيها الجموع وسار الناس فيها كالموج هائل حضر جنازة أعداد هائلة من الناس من مختلف مناطق المملكة ومدنها بل حتى من الدول المجاورة وخاصة دول الخليج الله المستعان اللهم اغفر الله ورحمه وكيف لا أبكي وقد تربيتنا أربعة عشر سنة